Oh, welcome back to uh, Newbie Farm, the 24 uh, day challenge or event. And I'm going to have company from Alice, which I didn't really want today. But uh, <laughs> what I want, what she wants, are two different things. But, oh, she's just gone. Alright, now I'm just going to clean up around the cattle and shove a bale of hay in just to keep them going today. I'm not certain we've got any eggs, we, we, uh, we have got a load of eggs, but they will have to wait. And then we will carry on with the uh, ripe harvest. Oh, because I left things all over the show. Alright, we better just get the wheel first, the wheel on a stick the infamous wheel on a stick and just clean clean this back in and I think I will I'll have a go at the grass again next um, I will make one more lot of silage I think we might as well do it so we've got plenty of silage where is it? Oh, it's over there missed it completely we we'll slow it right down here. That's better. Now, anybody who makes videos will tell you it's not the easiest thing in the world to drive and talk. I'm mar miles over that point. Just take it. Shall we find out? Oh, we'll take it. Oh. You can see the way I'm just hopping about here. Oh, it's like a like a five year old. Five year old what I don't really know. I don't already put it into a gear. Hmm, just lift that. Start it up and we just go through here quickly and just clear some of the stuff in there. Then we get Mm, I think that's a little bit too slow. Oh, of course, that's Miles' wife, and the. Yeah, I'm going to have to push that a bit. But I may not bother too much with that bit there. That will go overnight anyway. The funny thing is, I just don't put any grass in the, into the cattle. Well, I reckon I've got enough in the middle there to, to keep them going. But it's always grass they spit out. I know their stomachs are quite clever, but that is a little bit ridiculous. I think this will almost do it. I'll just see if I can just get in a bit closer. I'm going to slow, slow right down here. I just realised I'm almost muttering to myself, which is not the best thing. You've got a microphone you're meant to be talking into at a good volume. If you missed what I said there, there's nothing important. You haven't missed it. anything of any import at all. Well, you must have what I said, of no import. Right. I wonder if we can just do it. I don't really want to spend too long on this, but I would just like to. If I can move some of this in. Well what we do is we just go around behind it. And see so if we can just push all that in. I think there's some at the other end there, but I'm not gonna bother too much about that. But before we do that No. Best not, I was also gonna put a hay bale in. No, because once these bales are done we're gonna be on bulk. It's gonna speed things up a bit and one of the things at 15 times normal speed, even 24 days seasons, you haven't as much time when things get busy. When things are quiet, you've got plenty of time. But when things get busy, it's a different kettle of fish. I think that. I think we got rid of most of that. Man. 
if that's in the trigger, look that should go. Yes, that do do nice well, do nicely. Right, let's lift this and switch it off and put it back in place. Shove the bail forks on. And it's already uh, three o'clock, so we're not gonna get too much done. The light is summer, so we should have this, Got a fair amount of light still. I'm not going to collect the eggs. Ugh. Once that's full, that's full, and I will collect them when I've got a bit more, a bit more time. That's that's my story. I don't want to triple up here. We may have enough muck to build muck. At least one of the fields. I hope so. Have we got any ordinary bales? Ah, oh, that's the bale spikes. I knew I had some, but I couldn't remember where I'd put them. Let's go. Lift them up a bit. Don't particularly want to take them from this end, because they're new ones. One of these out here, if I can sneak in between the different bow forks. Soon, the only thing we're going to want bow forks for will be the uh, silage, and I've got another set of bows to try. I think we better just drop those a bit. No, let's try as we should. We should have it there. Oh, look at that. Oh. Oh. I'm amazed. I really am. Am I going to miss the pumps this side? Just. Come around here. Yep. Right. Let's chuck this in here. Chuck the bow forks off again and find what I've done with the trailer. <sighs> and we should get the equivalent to a couple of hours done anyway today. That should do it. Yeah, it's got rid of it. We have got a fair amount of silage, but I'd like to give it more in there. And when we get some money, we will, which was going to be for quite a while, we will actually throw a silage silo up. And I was thinking about it, it may not be on here yet. There is a map I'm particularly waiting for. A good mate of mine and the channels doing at the moment. And when he's got that done, as soon as I've got through a full year on here, this one will come up. I'll Continue playing it until, until such times as this, as the new map comes out. I haven't, act, I've seen pictures of it, but I haven't actually had a chance to look at it yet. I'm not certain what, last I heard he was over 70% done, he's done some work since. He was on the trees and I think that it was the trees were driving him nuts. Which I can, uh, I can understand. That's empty. Right, let's go and empty the combine out and start the combine up again. This, of course, is Newby Farm by Cavalier Roy. This is the. FS17 edition, as I said in the last one, I played the 15 edition and I'm actually playing the 19 edition at the moment. Although that could well change when 19 launches later this year. Yeah, we've just got used to 17. And we don't have quite so much, it's not as good as 15 anymore. In my mind, it's. 
it's as good if not better the only thing that's missing is one particular mod which I'd love to have seen brought forward and that's the soil mod but it's a lot of work for Decker and I'm not surprised he hasn't done it no well let me get it in there and I'll leave the, the engine running for a few minutes just in case I have to move Oh no, we can we can do it. So I'm gonna go out and just shut this down again. We don't need to keep it running. I know I'm one of my other ones. Uh, it, oh yeah, the uh, Drifter series. I keep one of the tractors running at all times because it's such a pain to uh, start again. I'm gonna keep the arm out now. I think should be all right doing that. So. Let's start it into two. And away we jolly well go. I do about three headlands. That's going to be quite a bit of this field done by the time I've done that. But I need room to make something I can turn around. Lol, there isn't collisions. Just the arm and hit me. Lol, there isn't collisions. On the on this map. No, I can't remember if this one yet. This is one you have to st stop it completely and put it into reverse. If you don't want horrible sounds. Alright, start that up again. Now, can I turn around in this space? Answers on a postcard. Now, let's put it like this. Most people would be able to turn, or, or turn around quite easily. But remember, it's me. Um, sitting a bit far forward, but I can't adjust the uh, head track. And, for some reason, there's something on the PC which has decided to block me from being able to adjust the head tracker in game, switch it on and off, and any extras from outside. I suspect the anti virus, but uh, trying to be very uh, careful. I might have to see if I can shove this on the exceptions and uh, so I can do what I actually want to do with it. Which, to be honest, it isn't huh. sitting here uh, not able to adjust my head track if that's not quite right. Uh, I decided to start trying with it again, although it you know, has been, it is a bit of a pain if it should go out. I will have to uh, jump out of the game, reset it, and come back in again. So it seemed to be behaving itself just lately. Oh, what else was that going on? Uh, I, th I th know that the duck is getting near the end of his year, and I think it will maybe it for him. I'm not certain. I know Jerry's definitely said when he's at the end of his year, it will be it for him, but he's quite a while away from that now. Uh oh. Oh, hasn't gone into gear, that's why. Have, whoops, that's what happens if you uh, try to start a wave with a little few revs on it if you're trying to change gear. It doesn't like it. Not one little bit and as we get the uh, auto save coming I'm just going to whip this bit out. It's annoying me there. I'm running up the hill a bit. Bang this bang in the gears, look like an old crash box. Well, think about it, this 
may well have had a crash box, of course. This is the uh, is it the bison from the uh, South American pack, which, as I said several times, to add it into this game, it looks dead right on there. You know, it, it does a slightly matter change from all the uh, massy stuff I have. The only thing I might update this for this one for is the class dominator which I have it in the mod folder. I won't get anything more mod than that. And unless things oh greatly the trackers are not gonna be updated either. Except for another Massey from the Massey pack. I'm going to start going up and down. I want to see if I can get can turn around in there. Probably being a complete idiot. Ah, I hit reverse. First time. This is this isn't going to take long. This is going to be quite a quick. As soon as we get this done, I'm just going to just finish off by collecting the eggs. Which there is a, a number. We still have the soy we're waiting to, for it to ripen enough to harvest. Harvest, and then we will go through autumn. Autumn is going to be a quiet month. You may not see much of autumn on screen. We'll wait until we get the winter and we start to. Uh, so, and no to Wonk or Co, I am not going to do logging. Logging is one of those things I don't much enjoy. Those are things I don't much enjoy, but the uh, certainly one of them. What I will do is uh, you come along with me whilst we prepare these fields. We won't have to plan this time, we can get away with. I went um, cultivate and put some muck on. This one shouldn't need muck, it should have chopped straw on it. But uh, the two we had wheat and barley and will need. Done. And I already decided that, uh, that field seven will be wheat or barley next year. We'll probably barley. Uh, ten will we'll probably have to be wheat again. Or well, ten or eleven will have to be wheat. Then we'll sort out what we'll put in the other ones. I think we may we may actually buy a header and do some sunflower. I haven't done sunflower yet on this map. Hey, choices, 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 there we go. We're getting full, I think we better. Whoa. Whoa, 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 whoa. Bring this out and just empty it out. We'll just take out, knock it out of here. And run across to the tractor. Oh, yeah, we missed a bit there. I think one more fill and we'll be done. Steady round and in here. Now this is where we slow ourselves right down. To give ourselves the best chance of actually getting this spout over the trailer. Now what's it is I think we'll run into that crop what's left there. Oh, 
I won't till it's empty because I want to move this out the way because I want to get that little bit of crop there. I'm going to do reverse ready. I'm holding in gear. You know, probably not the brightest thing I've ever done. Should should almost get the rest of the field in here, I think. Turn it off again. Let's, let's get this a little bit. We'll probably clear that up at the end. I'm trying to pretend that these hedges are actually non-collidable. That doesn't we come down this side. Why not? Why not? Why not? Seems to make sense now. There's so little left to do. I keep the spout on the outside all the time. Hey, the boy's thinking. Well, at the moment I'm getting well ahead and having videos by it. It's handy, that means I can tell If something turns up, I haven't got a thing, I ain't got a video to go out. This exercise, 24 day, has been great fun. I'm at times it gets very busy when just you you've got rain or snow all around and you've only got a certain amount of time to do a job oh, come round this side again where is it ah oh, two more passes should do it and then of course you get long periods we haven't got anything to do this is where those who enjoy logging can keep pumping out videos on, oh, no not pumping out, keep creating videos, pumping out sort of diminishes it a bit, it's something I didn't realise when I started making videos two, two plus years ago now, just what work was involved and what dedication you needed, no. I finally got myself down to making the proper schedule and sticking to it, which is happened in the early days, I didn't. You may, if you look at some of the early videos, I'm going to do such and such out every day, or every Tuesday, such and such thing. Never worked. Now, I seem to manage to persuade myself that this sensible thing to do is to have a schedule and stick to it. Now, I'm I do a lot of different farms. I, I get bored easily. That's half the trouble. Now, I'm, I'm also slightly odd in the fact that I like starting farms, and I like once they've got mature. It's getting to the mature stage. I'm not so keen on. I'm going to have to make another pass. So the years two, three, two, three, and possibly four. I'm not quite so keen on. But once it once a farm gets mature and it takes on a life of its own and nothing more uh, central to that argument than old ridge on FS15 which I'm still playing at 530 yards on one map it, no, it has a life of its own it, the characters that are alive I know who's dealing with who and when I start this excitement of a new map well in some cases on the Drifter series an old map but uh, with a different idea to it let's just take this little piece over here that's it that looks better oh. ok 
keep forgetting I've got to change the, the gear on the stick. Oh, oh. So that's what happens if you don't let the thing wind down fully. It doesn't like it. And there's nothing left there. So I think all we've got is this row and. one little wisp left at the far end and we're done I'm going to leave the uh, combine out here I might have to mow it about a bit because it will end up in the way it always does what's the thing got to be oh we've got plenty of time before I've got to maintain it tons of time Okay, it would be, this is new in. I don't think I'm going to be maintaining it in this uh, game. On this map. And I would actually, uh, to pick the looking for a, a different map. Uh, so you may realise I don't play the big AAA maps. Uh, not because I don't like them, I love them. But everybody does them. So I always stick to these I'm just going to say it's lesser ones they're not lesser the lesser well known ones but here newbie it's a very nice map indeed ah I see full doesn't look like it well I didn't fall I must have just Ah, uh, we moved a bit, put the brake on. Hopefully we get it all in there, it's going to be a bit of a shame if we can't. We have to come back for 100 kilos or so. No, that's all there. Right. I have got to work on this field. But this will be the will be the last one of the three cuts so far to be done. Alright, shut it all. Oh, oh, better bring that. Oops. Hit the wrong hit the wrong button. How are we doing on time? Oh, I don't think we will be doing much else. We'll just take this back and tip this off. Now, it helps if you head in forward, of course. There we are, a well harvest field, and we've got quite a bit of canola at our right. Funny thing is the last canola on screen, if you look, I think it's the same on 17, it certainly was on 15, if you look in to the inner workings of the game, it's down as rape, same as corn, it's down as maize. One more to lot to harvest, then we can jolly well get on with the. Uh, we're selling it. Well, I'm probably wait until the winter. That's apparently it's when the best prices should be. And we've first just hope there isn't snow. So my off-screen map, which is the 19 version of this. On six days, I had four days of snow. Yeah, as you heard, right, four out of six days of snow. One was rain, which turned to snow, and the penultimate day was overcast. I couldn't move a dang thing. I was stuck to only be able to uh, sell at the port. It's the only place. Let's see, it's down. 
it was the only place which I could get to once I got the yard here. We will need this again, so we're not going to bother to go. We will have a quick look round. Go and collect the eggs and uh, whoop. Keep in the wrong keys. And I think to, uh, we will be back here tomorrow. Be animals. Oh, yeah. Certainly will be animals. Animals and. Then we'll probably cut a piece of uh, some grass or to turn to hay. What we got? We'll, yeah, we should be all right. Just, just if I was well, just to take note of what I was doing, one thing at a time, I'd be a lot better off. Yeah, we can cut tomorrow because it's going to be sunny. It's going to be all the cast next day, but that's okay. That will uh, so it gives us two days to to mow the grass and collect it and the silage mm, might be the end of the summer or even take it into uh, autumn and I will do one more lot of silage I'll do that off the other field off the other meadow and there's no start to get dark this is using the real night or the darker night mod and it is a beast when it starts getting dark you can't see a thing so not many eggs we've got I hope have a look I suppose uh, we've got that six left to find I do prefer maps where they all lie in one place I think Johnny V's got it a bit right, he's but an area where they lay under cover. And it makes it quick but not too quick. I thought that was one there but it wasn't. They have this habit of laying a couple of eggs on the uh, fence posts. Uh, very talented chickens we have here. Mm. I just, I just said horrible thought I hadn't taken a screenshot. Now remember, I don't take screenshots for this series. The only one I don't. All right, as well. Right, let's get along here. I think there was nothing along here. Oh, I'm not going to find the other ones. I'll bet you will have. But you say, I'll bet you're giving me the pantomime show. They're behind you. Uh, no, no, they have to be have to be in the centre somewhere. No grass to really hide them. Might have to speed this mouse up a bit. It's a bit slow for this game. I remember how. It's a bit better. That's better. One of these G900 uh, Chaos mice uh, with, with on, on the fly change and it works. The trouble is, I keep hitting the button to, and it slows it down by accident. <laughs> yes, yeah, yeah, yeah. you heard me say that a lot. I hit buttons by accident. Don't let me near a nuclear plant. Well, I think that's it. I can't find the others. How many we got anyway? And what's been looking up this? Uh, oh, 445. That's going to be worth for some soon. Right. With that, I'm going to say thank you very much for watching. If you like what you saw, please consider leaving a like. If you're not a subscriber, I wish to see more of this rubbish. I mean, my gameplay. No, I wrote the first one. And more of my rubbish. Uh, feel free to subscribe. Always happy to have you along. I don't take things too seriously. <laughs> Although I do try and do things somewhere near correctly. 
And what we've got in here, see how we can get rid of? No, not really. I just wonder if there's anything we could sell. I'd like to get the money together because we are not exactly well off. I'm going to move this. No, I'll move it. Oh, I'll move it later. I don't know why there yet. We've got plenty of silage here. This is all. Yeah, that's silage. Right. Yes, any comments, questions, queries, or, or anything else you want to post, post. Feel free to post them in the comment section under this video. I read every one and I try and reply to every one. So with that, it's me saying a cheerio for now. Cheerio.